now, here's Chief Meteorologist Tony Petrarca with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 Futurecast. It certainly doesn't feel like uh, mid-June. Temperatures only in the low 60s. It's still wet, though it's not a heavy rain. It's just a mist and drizzle. You don't see as much green on the Doppler radar, and uh, essentially the uh, heaviest of the precipitation pulling out. But still some little speckles of green coming through, occasional drizzle and mist, and that'll pretty much be the scenario throughout most of the night, especially the first half of the night. In fact, you can see the low clouds in downtown Providence, the fog off in the distance, and that drizzle, which continues news off and on temperature that's it 63 calendar version of summer but only a week away. South breeze at 7, of course, no surprise here. Humidity very high at 93%. You can see the gray skies covering most of New England right now. Low 60s, low to mid 60s in most locations. Westerly 63, Taunton 64, New Bedford coming in at 63. And I can see the steadier rain from last night and early this morning uh, pulling offshore. But there's on the bottom of your TV set is, is a developing storm. And what that is doing is enhancing uh, more of an east and northeasterly wind off the ocean. So it's going to maintain clouds and damp conditions through the overnight. Uh, sunshine already coming out in Albany, New York, and as a result, temperatures out here were close to 80. That drier air headed our way for tomorrow, more than likely by tomorrow afternoon. It'll start off kind of slow in the morning with low clouds and a few sprinkles. Futurecast shows this well. 7 o'clock this evening and beyond. Every now and then a little smattering of green indicating some sprinkle and some drizzle. Now here we are tomorrow morning, 7 a.m. We start off with mainly cloudy skies. And you can see, especially eastern Massachusetts, these little tiny elements of green coming in in a northeast, uh, northeast wind. That's just a hint of some a few sprinkles tomorrow morning. This is 10 a.m. But notice by late morning and throughout the afternoon, especially mid to late afternoon, we start to see increasing amounts of sunshine. This is 5 o'clock in the afternoon, and then by tomorrow evening, we are clear. So kind of a slow start in the morning, and then improving in the afternoon. Mist and drizzle overnight uh, for this evening. Temperatures in the low 60s, some areas of fog overnight. Temperatures holding in the uh, lower 60s. And by tomorrow morning, especially early, we'll start off with clouds, a few sprinkles very early in the morning, 64 to 68, the range in temperature. But by late morning, and certainly during the afternoon, we start to see some increasing amounts of sunshine. It'll turn into a better second half of the day as temperatures respond to some of that brightening getting up into the, at least the lower 70s. Alright, seven day outlook. Friday still looks nice. Sunshine a little warmer in the mid to upper 70s. Father's Day weekend, Saturday and Sunday, delightful, comfortable, dry air, sunshine, mid to upper 70s during the day, in the 50s at night. We start to see a significant warm up next week as temperatures get back into the 80s. So, you know, green light on all outdoor activities this weekend, probably a lot of uh, graduation parties and things like that, and the weather looks good. Okay, yeah. thank you, Tony. Still ahead, and I would.